Check on me. We got time. He's gonna check on me. There you go. Time out of that 
like to take this opportunity. From novice to aficionado, find yourself here. High quality cigars plus personal customer service. Slow Burn is Waco's only mobile cigar lounge, featuring a meticulous curated collection of premium cigars. Visit our website, www.slowburnwaco.com. That's www.slowburnwaco.com. When it comes to going to a show And the kick is good. Score now. Open the state.
to professional learning, teachers deserve better. From the leader in online learning, Stride brings you the Stride Professional Development Center, an on-demand library of mobile-friendly courses that gives teachers choice and flexibility, allowing them to learn anytime and anywhere. Our dynamic courses provide bite-sized learning and help educators advance their knowledge while also gaining professional development hours. It's time you take charge of your learning. Visit us today to get started. If you think all pads are exactly the same, think again. This is Always Ultra Thins reinvented with the Always Triple Protection System. This pad wicks gushes 90% faster, absorbs even more so you can feel dry, and locks odors in. Rethink your pad for up to 100% leak-free and odor-free comfort with the totally reinvented Always Ultra Thins. This is always like never before. The Cuvée Group is a Florida-based marketing and training consulting firm. We help businesses communicate to their target audience and engage them in conversation. We also help to expand their audiences, which will ultimately result in growth for those organizations. In addition to being a certified constant contact specialist, my colleagues and I are also certified in John Maxwell Leadership Principles. We use these proven principles to conduct workshops, training, and private coaching sessions for individuals and companies looking to take things to the next level. Contact us to schedule a free consultation. Issues today, don't delay, call Cuvay. As technology continues to bring changes to the world of education, it's time we also reimagine teacher professional development. Gone are the days of one-size-fits-all learning that can only be accessed at a specific time and place. The Stride PD Center is an on-demand library of mobile-friendly courses that allow educators to learn anytime and anywhere. Our dynamic courses provide bite-sized learning and help educators advance their knowledge while also gaining professional development hours. The best professional development plans are those that include a level of flexibility and choice for educators. Whether you're a teacher, school, or district, Visit us today to take charge of your learning. 
it's never too early to plant the seed, to share the tradition, and instill a sense of pride in your HBCU with your little ones. HBCU Pride and Joy Children's Boutique helps you share your school spirit with a wide selection of adorable kids apparel and accessories officially licensed from your favorite HBCU. Visit HBCUPrideJoy.com and follow us on all social media at HBCU Pride Joy on Facebook and Twitter. This is Ryan Fulford. A.D. Drew and I are co-hosts of the BCSN Sports Wrap. We talk about all things related to HBCU athletics. From the games, teams, coaches, and fan interest stories, we cover it all. You can find our shows on Facebook at BCSN Sports Wrap, YouTube at MyJBN Online, and everywhere you listen to podcasts like Anchor, Spotify, Google, and Apple Podcasts. You can also find the show on the Jericho Broadcast Network's app. Make sure to download. We look forward to you joining the conversation and being a part of the show. I'm returning to Clinton, Paris, and Tampa's my community. I grew up here, went to school here, and my wife and I make our home here. What makes Tampa special are its people. So when I represent someone injured in my community, it's personal. Call my office and speak to a real lawyer and not some referral service. I will fight the insurance companies to get the settlement that you deserve. At the law office of Clinton, Paris, we take the pain out of being hurt. Since 2002, Empowerment Resources, Inc., a nonprofit organization, has empowered more than 1,500 youth and adults in Duval and surrounding counties. Through its programs, Journey into Womanhood, Girls Mentoring, Life Skills for Teens, and Parenting Education Coaching. To get involved with programs, volunteer, or donate, visit www.empowermentresourcesinc.org. Follow us on social media, facebook.com forward slash empowerment.resources and instagram.com forward slash empowermentjax. Since 2002, Empowerment Resources, Inc., a nonprofit organization, has empowered more than 1,500 youth and adults in Duval and surrounding counties. Through its programs, Journey into Womanhood, Girls Mentoring, Life Skills for Teens, and Parenting Education Coaching. To get involved with programs, volunteer, or donate, visit www.empowermentresourcesinc.org. Follow us on social media, facebook.com forward slash empowerment.resources and instagram.com forward slash empowermentjax. The human voice has always connected audiences with experiences. Major brands all across America have trusted Kevers Voice time and time again. Conversational, powerhouse, intelligent, and sincere. That's the voice you need for your creative marketing process. K-E-A-V-E-R-S-V-O-I-C-E dot com. Kevers Voice, Kevers Voice, Kevers Voice dot com. Always on, all the time.
the windows back. And now, the original, the first plus side inclusive dance team. And ladies and gentlemen, the ever walked to mercy. Purple Thunder! Picker-upper. Bounty picks up messes quicker, and each sheet is two times more absorbent, so you can use less. He's an eight. He's a nine. Bounty, the quicker picker-upper. From novice to aficionado, find yourself here. High-quality cigars plus personal customer service. Slow Burn is Waco's only mobile cigar lounge, featuring a meticulous curated collection of premium cigars. Visit our website, www.slowburnwaco.com. That's www.slowburnwaco.com. Itchy, squirmy, scratchy, family not getting clean? Get Charmin Ultra Strong. Go get them. It just cleans better. With a diamond weave texture, your family can use less while still getting clean. Goodbye, itchy squirm. Hello, clean bottom. <laughs> we all go. Why not enjoy the go with Charmin? 
At Hampton Law, our primary goal is to provide non-traditional yet effective solutions and redefine the approach to client legal concerns. As your trusted legal advisor, we believe in sophisticated, personalized services that eliminate the confusion and complexity sometimes associated with legal matters. Our high standard for client care and concern, coupled with our extensive legal knowledge and skills, make Hampton Law a resource focused on the protection of the client's interest and overall goals. We value our clients and truly enjoy working with them. Visit thamptonlaw.com to conveniently schedule an appointment online. Tamika Hampton Esquire, 1631 Rock Springs Road, Suite 336, Apopka, Florida, 407-494-1471. thamptonlaw.com Nope. Nope. You want him? Ooh, I like him. Quick, the quicker picker upper. Bounty picks up messes quicker, and each sheet is two times more absorbent, so you can use less. He's an eight. He's a nine. Bounty, the quicker picker upper. From novice to aficionado, find yourself here. High quality cigars plus personal customer service. Slow Burn is Waco's only mobile cigar lounge featuring a meticulous curated collection of premium cigars. Visit our website www.slowburnwaco.com That's www.slowburnwaco.com When it comes to professional learning, teachers deserve better. From the leader in online learning, Stride brings you the Stride Professional Development Center an on-demand library of mobile-friendly courses that gives teachers choice and flexibility, allowing them to learn anytime and anywhere. Our dynamic courses provide bite-sized learning and help educators advance their knowledge while also gaining professional development hours. It's time you take charge of your learning. Visit us today to get started. If you think all pads are exactly the same, think again. This is Always Ultra Thin's reinvented with the Always Triple Protection System. This pad wicks gushes 90% faster, absorbs even more so you can feel dry, and locks odors in. Rethink your pad for up to 100% leak-free and odor-free comfort with the totally reinvented Always Ultra Thins. This is always like never before. The Cuvée Group is a Florida-based marketing and training consulting firm. We help businesses communicate to their target audience and engage them in conversation. We also help to expand their audiences, which will ultimately result in growth for those organizations. In addition to being a certified constant contact specialist, my colleagues and I are also certified in John Maxwell Leadership Principles. We use these proven principles to conduct workshops, training, and private coaching sessions for individuals and companies looking to take things to the next level. Contact us to schedule a free consultation. Issues today, don't delay, call Cuvay.
Here on the play clock, 12.37 on the game clock here in the third. Tigers down 10. Russell takes the step. Back to pass. Option pitch over here to G. He's going to be short of the first down. As he goes out of bounds, out of line, the 17 yard line. Where he's pushed out of bounds. Fourth down and maybe about four on the play, and the punting unit will come on here to four at the Waters. So State gets a three and out on their opening drive, and the Waters three and out as well. They're coming off the front here for it. He will be new. Will be a sports of the day. Snap. Cut. The boy is decent. The Waters offense finally getting in gear here. They desperately need to. Now it's all on the defense here. And they get this stop once again. It's a three out on the opening draw for Albany State. It's a steady dose of pretty game here. He rushes the day. Already with over 100 yards today. Rushing takes the ball away with the 43. Takes the snap. And off the game from their side. Runs right into a man and is brought down to the backfield. Jonathan Gregory. In the gap, cutting in and making a stop on the play. Loss of a yard on the play. Backs the football up to the 41 yard line. I'll check that'll be a loss of two on the play. Nice job there by the transfer. From Norfolk State. Had an interception last week up there in Tuskegee. Second and five at the 41. Start on formation. The bottom gains back side time to the right. Swim fish to that far side to the left. Second and 12 now here for the Golden Rams. Final pass to Sands takes the snap. Back to pass. Pass. Blacks on the trap. Pass is complete. Short of the first down. Most likely an offside against Evan Waters. Pass to the route. Love it. But an offside penalty. It looks like they may get. Jared Wilson for being in the neutral zone at the snap. Tried to time that snap. Got to just a bit early. Love it made the reception out to the Edward Waters 47 yard line. Here appears he has a little down. 23. Yeah, that will be enough on first down. So first down for Albany State. Little dark game there for Wild Woods. Almost thought it would be at the first 27 yard line. Bottom of the gun. Dorsey reset. Three to the far side left. I played this side to the right side of Dorsey. On that side, far to the left of Bottom is Trey Gaines. Takes the snap. Back to pass. Comes out to Gaines on the far side. They're going to bring him down in the backfield. Flag throw and wait to see what this impaction is going to be. Here yeah. from Floyd Willingham once again today. Uh, for water so far here tonight. Five penalty for 30 yards. Four for 31. No so Ralph Lovett guilty of the holding call, so I backed them up 10 yards. Back to their own side of the 50-yard line. And Albany State will finish down from their own 52-yard line. And 32 left to go here in third quarter. Albany State 24, Edward Water 14. Now say Bono works from the gun. Okay, let's work with the pistol. But he gains right behind him. Stop and play now. 
started the right. And that is one more yard. And now the Golden Lions will scrimmage from their own 43 yard line. First and 20 from there. Otto in the pistol, Daniels behind him. Four receiver pass, three right, single far side to the left. That was rushing four here. Takes the snap, handoff, Gaines, and a steam. It's going to be hit and brought down short of midfield. Out at the midfield strike. It's going to be a little bit of the midfield strike. Gregory in on the stop there for Edward Waters. Second down. 14 or so. No, they know it's 14 or 15, I should say. At midfield. 9.23 left to go here. Talking about Thomas McGaman running back for Albany State. He's standing to the right of quarterback Deontay Pato. One receiver near side to the right. Single cross from that to the left side of the wing right. Takes the snap. Back to pass to Pato. Pato looking. Pato throwing. This is incomplete. Pass incomplete. Will be third down here. Pass and send it over here on the other side. Return Jackson. I think Jackson will make it. 170 for freshman. Third down and 13 here for the Golden Rams at midfield. And Edward Waters get on the field one more time here defensively. Otto will work for the guy. Now Janot Thomas is running back side car to the left. Four receiver set. Take that three receiver set. Tight end out those to the line. He'll be in the wing to the right. Takes the snap, takes the handoff, back to pass, looking, looking, trying to the screen pass, incomplete! Fantastic job there by the Zabby Barnes defense, the appearance of a settle there, back to back, three and out here for the Albany State offense. Wilbur Brown coming on to punt once again, a dangerous Johnny Jones back to field this one here for the Purple and Orange. Jones has been close to breaking punts. For touchdowns, so many times here this season. One would be definitely needed here. There is the snap. There is the punt. Out of the way. High end over end, but Honey will not watch it bounce. It will bounce away from him. It will take an Albany State roll. It'll be down into the end zone for a touchback. All just crossing the line. Here's a little bit of touchback. Well, they're not going to have to Wow. the half yard line. So, Edward Roberts is going to have to go 99 and a half. Let's do this one here. 42 left to go here until the end of the third quarter. Albany State 24, Edward Waters 14. Joshua Jackson here with you. Listening on 1010 XL. Deuce from Rob Macchio on the ones and twos back in Hogan Road. Watching us here on the Black Child Sports Network. The man, the myth, the legend, my fellow rattler, Florida Indian University, the host of BCS and Game Prime, the BCS and Game Time Show, Sports Rap Show, Brian Fulford. Deuce is here. First and ten for Edward Waters at their own half yard line. Moving left here in this third quarter of play. Shot in formation for Russell. One back side to our left. Takes the snap. And off to the right side and steps out. And did he did get to the one to the one yard line? The out the one yard line. That was John Terry Thomas on the carry. Was stacked up on the middle to show some strength and get out of his own end zone to avoid another safety. Second down and at 10. Edward Waters, number one. Also on the gun. Three receivers, six. Seven receivers split out far side to the right, single near side to the left. Second and 10 from the one. Open state. Even at the line, they're salivating. Sean Blitz here. Takes the snap, takes the handoff, back to pass to Russell. Russell trying to take the shot, far side, looks for a man, he just pulls oh, it! What did I catch me? My name's Nathan Are you kidding me, young man? 
Multi healing was sent to out of the midfield. Show off your man. Game the 49 on the play. First and 10 for Edward Waters back at midfield. Shotgun formation for Jared Russell. Does that give Edward Waters some life here? Takes the snap. Hand takes the handoff. Russell throwing cross high. Pass will be right down more. First down and more as he's tripped up inside the 45 and down to the 42 yard line. What a catch, Mickey. Unbelievable. Nathan River. Leading receiver in the SIAC. First and 10 for the Tigers at the 40 yard line. Takes the snap. Handoff. John Terry Thomas coming to the near side. Breaks one tackle. Gets inside the 40. Goes out to the 39 yard line. And play. Back thrown in the, the public state's backfield. Could this be an issue of a substitution in here? Here at the Ford Willingham, here in just a few moments. As we're going to find out the SIAC. Uh, uh, Ottawa was the problem. He's talking to the mic. <laughs> Willingham and umpire Christopher Sherman want to have one more. How about that catch? A few moments ago there by Nathan River. Another big first down for Edward Waters out of the penalty. First and ten for Edward Waters. Ball's moved up to now the 37 yard line of Albany State. 653 and counting here. Third quarter. Tigers down by 10, but showing some life here in Albany State territory. First and 10 for 37 of ASU. Russell in the gun. Thomas the running back to the right. Swing receivers far side to the right. Single receiver near side to the left is Giannis Rogers. Also puts a receiver in motion to Johnny Jones. Number 30 takes it to the side. Takes that. Takes the handoff. Back to pass. It will be a tough and run for Russell. Russell looking a little bit of room. Russell is going to be hitting two round. Inside the 30. Down to the 29. Game of nine yards there for the starting quarterback for Edward Waters. 28. Russell needed a coming in today. Needed 194 passing yards. Flips. 28. 28. Single season of passing record here for Edward Waters. He's at 158 right now. Second in the yard. Takes the snap. Hand off. John Terry is trying to stack that line. No gain on the play. He came out late. Thomas is already on the ground. Third down in the yard for Edward Waters. At the Albany State 29 yard line. 543 and counting for the third quarter. Albany State 24, Edward Waters 14. Shout out to my good friend and brother Brian Snow. In our broadcast. Give us a lot of our drops here. All the network. Third down in the hour. Pistol formation here for Edward Waters. Takes the snap. Turn, hand, Thomas. First down. As he picks the play, did the ball come out late? I say that he was down. It will be a first down for Edward Waters. Over the points for football for the Tigers. Got down to the 25 yard line and we'll move the change right up with Waters first now. First and 10 for Edward Waters at the 25 yard line of Albany State. 425 to go here, third quarter. Tigers down. 24 14, but showing some signs of sight here. Russell throwing, got a man, and it is incomplete. Looking for Rembert over on the far side, pass falls incomplete. Rembert able to step out of a near stack there from the linebacker Rosendo Lewis. Second down in 10 for Edward Waters at the 25 yard line of Albany State. Clock stops at four, he's got to go here in the third. Also works in the gun. 
That's the rest of the work of the first one. Usually right behind her. And the team will play. Most now. Or then Brian Jacobs. Four seconds on play by now. Three seconds. Two seconds. Here's the snap. Far side. Trying to spin his way. Back down to the 25 yard line. Gain of maybe two on the play. Or check that. No gain on the play, I should say. Third down and 10 from the 25. Another third down situation here. Tigers, four of nine on third down here tonight. 334. 333 and counting. Third and 10 from the 25 of Albany State. Pistol formation. Your receiver set. Jones in motion. Now he swings to the far side right. Takes the snap. Takes a hand up. Going far side to Jones. Jones to the 25. To the 20. Still on his feet. Inside the 15. Jones a big hit inside the 15. Goes down at the 12. Big play there for Johnny Jones. And a first down for Adam Waters as we move the chains. First and 10 for the time here at the 12-yard line of Albany State. Last spot at the 13, excuse 29, me. 29, 29, 29. 2.58 left to go here, third quarter. Tigers trying to get back in the end zone here. Pistol formation. UG right behind Russell. The receivers. They're going to be twin receivers on the side of the formation. Takes the snap. Takes the handoff. Looking to throw. Far side throws the ball away. Under the rest by... The outside linebacker, Maurice McDonald, for Albany State. Pass all is incomplete. I will stop at 238 left to go here in the third. Take it down and 10 for Amber Waters at the 13-yard line of Albany State. In the gun is Russell. Use your backside to the left. Morrissey was set. Swings back far side to the right. Swings back side to the left. The lines are Rogers and Weber at the slots. Are Jones and McCorker. Throw the Rams rushing four. It's on the play clock now. Five and four. Take the snap. Low snap. Take the hand up. Back to pass. Looking for a cross that pass. Complete that is UG. UG is tripped up inside the 10. Goes down to the nine yard line. Third down and maybe three ish. At the nine. And we'll call it third down and we'll call it, what's it, what, five? Third and five at the nine. Shotgun formation for Russell. Four receiver set. Isolated left side to the left is Yannis Rogers. Three receivers on the far side right. That's Jones and McCorp on the slots. The wide is Nathan Rivers. He's the back side, Tyler left and right. Takes the snap. Hand off, takes the hand off. Next is Russell. Jordan for the far side. Russell looking. Russell's going to throw this one incomplete. Pass falls incomplete. It is in Irving Freeman field goal range. It will send the graduate transfer from the University of Oklahoma on to the field for such a field goal. This one will be out of the hold of. Backup quarterback Keith Moore. The 25 yard field goal attempt. Try to make this a touchdown ball game. Snap, spot, kick up all the way. It is good. 141 left to go here, third quarter. With the third one ball game here in Jacksonville. Open State 20. Edward Waters 17. Let's take a timeout. Back with more to this right here on the Edward Waters Sports Network. Oh, sports. <laughs> As technology continues to bring changes to the world of education, it's time we also reimagine teacher professional development. Gone are the days of one size fits all learning that can only be accessed at a specific time and place. The Stride PD Center is an on-demand library of mobile-friendly courses that allow educators to learn anytime and anywhere. Our dynamic courses provide bite-sized learning and help educators advance their knowledge while also gaining professional development hours. The best professional development plans are those that include a level of flexibility and choice for educators. 
Whether you're a teacher, school, or district, visit us today to take charge of your learning. It's never too 25 yard field goal with that good for Irving Freeman. One forty left to go here in the third quarter. Tigers down to seven. 24 17. Yeah. 4 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 6 Love it, the wide receiver on the far side, guilty of twitching just a bit early to the cost his team five yards. Back the football up to the Ever Waters 47 yard line. Top and play now. Back it up one more yard to the 48. And the gun is Botto. To the left is game. The receiver set. First and 15 at the Ever Waters 48. I mean, it will be the seven point ball game. <coughs> Excuse me. Five, seven, eight, 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 water defense takes the snap. Back to pass. Looking, right, looking, it's looking. Watch the pocket now. Little one here's the near side. Still looking for the He's got to run. And will go out of bounds. Inside the 45 and out of bounds around the 43 yard line. And five on the play for Bono. Michael football at the 48. Trying to get six on the wheel, spot at 42. Take it down at nine on the play. Golden Rams, 22 seconds left to go here at third. Seven point lead for Albany State. Take the backfield here for Bono. Now they shift and bring into the backfield. It'll be a running back side going to the left. You were set now, I am wing left. Thanks for setup. Hand off. Names. The side with Rome, 35. 30, Megan Fitness with finally going out of bounds. Inside the 30-yard line. Stop and play now. That'll be the final play. Right forward. So we've got an exciting one set up here on for ourselves here in the fourth quarter. We go to the fourth, the money period. Albany State 24. Everyone is 17. Driving in, hold on tight. Back with the exciting fourth after this right here. Water Sports Network. Early to plant the seed, to share the tradition, and instill a sense of pride in your HBCU with your little ones. 
HBCU Pride and Joy Children's Boutique helps you share your school spirit with a wide selection of adorable kids apparel and accessories officially licensed from your favorite HBCU. Visit HBCUPrideJoy.com and follow us on all social media at HBCU Pride Joy on Facebook and Twitter. This is Brian Fulford. A.D. Drew and I are co-hosts of the BCSN Sports Wrap. We talk about all things related to HBCU athletics. From the games, teams, coaches, and fan interest stories, we cover it all. You can find our shows on Facebook at BCSN Sports Wrap, YouTube at MyJBN Online, and everywhere you listen to podcasts like Anchor, Spotify, Google, and Apple Podcasts. You can also find the show on the Jericho Broadcast Network's app. Make sure to download. We look forward to you joining the conversation and being a part of the show. Aaron Jackson gets for the Jacksonville made. Second down and long. 
Honor the wind of God. Thomas the back to the right. Three receivers near side left. Single cross line to the right. Takes the snap. Back to pass is Bono. Bono flush. Rolling to the right now. We'll tuck and we'll run. Bono's going to be hitting submarine as he crossed the 20. Goes down at around the 17 yard line. Third down and long. Around the 17. Third down and fifth. Third down and 15. Bono works on the gun. Into the back side, all right. Over we'll receiver set. Third and 15. Takes the snap. Back to pass the bottom. Bono look. Bono's throwing it. It's caught inside the five. Dragging defenders with them. Down to the goal line. Still pushing the pile and down to the one. Ralph Lovett on the post route. We'll give Albany State first and goal. Around the one. Big play there for Deontay Bono. Backbreaker there for Evan Waters. Down seven with 10 from seven to go here in the fourth. Shotgun formation for Bono. Gain for back side, draw left. Three receivers set. Hiding wing right. Takes the snap. Takes the handoff. Bono keeps. Bono dies into the end zone. Touchdown, but there is a flag thrown, however. That's holding going to be the call here against Albany State. Now, I've had brain off. Offensive lineman, 6'1", 300, out of Jonesboro, Georgia. Okay. He'll be the only guy to call that one, too. Wise off the touchdown, back the football up to now. 13 yard line. Bono will work from the pistol. Kevin will work from the gun. Gain to the back side, throw left. Two receivers split up, draw side to the right. Bono, shovel pass to Gain. Breaking tackle. Inside the 10, inside the 5. No signal yet. Down to the 2. Shovel pass for Freddie Gaines. It's bouncing off a defender. Down inside the 5. We found it on the, it looks like maybe the three. Second goal from there. Nine for the eight is coming here. Third quarter. Four, excuse me. Second down by seven. In the gun is Bono. Moves to the left. First one's put on there by the takes a wide step. Hand off the gate. Gate stacked up at the line and pushed back. Take that. The team at Old Purple got to play football here tonight. Stuck their head in there, made the stop for the Jacksonville Native. The third and goal for Albany State. The ball back up to now around the four yard line. Clock runs. 9 10 left to go here in the fourth quarter. They lost one. Tigers down by seven. Albany State with the football. Third and goal at the Edward Water School. Shotgun formation. Games to the right of Bono. Will receiver set. So they used to be able to order defense. So send Bono. He'll set games on the back. He'll take the snap. Back to pass to Bono. Bono throwing. Back in. Don't take the way to the plate. Fantastic job there by the defensive back and Jonathan Gregory. It's fourth and goal now. And the kicking in will come on here for Albany State. Eli Mashburn on to kick here. Yeah. 
Now this is a small victory for all the waters, even if you didn't complete the three points. As we're on to kick the field goal, this one will be a 21 yard field goal except from the far side right hand. But to extend the lead to five. Movement along the line of scrimmage. What we have here. No. Both teams pointing at each other. Yep. The referee, the line judge, and I believe the umpire are having a discussion as to who is going to be. It was thrown by the line judge. Who's this one going to be? Lay of game penalty against Edward Waters. Moves the football up. It's a little bit of a closer field goal attempt here for Eli Mansford. It will now be our field goal attempt. Yeah, five, kick up all the way. It's good. Eight minutes left to go here. Fourth quarter, Albany State 27, Edward Water 17. Let's take time out here on the Edward Water Sports Network. I'm returning to Clinton, Paris, and Tampa's my community. I grew up here, went to school here, and my wife and I make our home here. What makes Tampa special are its people. So when I represent someone injured in my community, it's personal. Call my office and speak to a real lawyer and not some referral service. I will fight the insurance companies to get the settlement that you deserve. At the law office of Clinton Paris, we take the pain out of being hurt. Since 2002, Empowerment Resources, Inc., a nonprofit organization, has empowered more than 1,500 youth and adults in Duval and surrounding counties. Through its programs, Journey into Womanhood, Girls Mentoring, Life Skills for Teens, and Parenting Education Coaching. To get involved with programs, volunteer, or donate, visit www.empowermentresourcesinc.org. Follow us on social media, facebook.com forward slash empowerment.resources and instagram.com forward slash empowerment, J-A-X. Back to pass. 
Looking, looking, going, passes. And complete. That is Rimbert. Rimbert across the 40. And going out of bounds. Nathan Rimbert. Zerlot was considered for Yuji. Rimbert's right there. Makes the catch. Brings the defender with him out to the 44 yard line. The timer's along the chain. Points in the end. Rimbert across the 40. Rimbert at their own 44 yard line. 26 and counting four quarter. Tigers down 10. Russell in an empty backfield. They go five wide. Three receivers cross side to the left. Swings this side right. Back to pass is Russell. Russell looking at Russell throwing pass. Is complete to Rimber. Rimber still on his feet. Makes a man miss. Goes out of bounds. Across the 50 yard line. Out to maybe a little spot at midfield. Six on the play. A freshman from Houston, Florida. Second and four down for Edward Waters at midfield. Seven to eight and counting here in the fourth quarter. Russell and the gun. Seems to the back side, turn to the left. Four receiver set, swings along the side of the formation. Over the round, rushing four. Takes the snap, takes the handoff. Back to pass is Russell. Russell throwing in the pass completes the QG. He's just going to have the first down as he goes out of bounds. Inside the 45 and down to the 44 yard line. First and 10 for Edward Waters at the Albany State 44 yard line. 6.43 and counting here remaining in the fourth quarter. Tigers down 10. Russell will work from the gun. He's the back side. Connor to the left. Four receiver set to the other side of the 40. Takes the snap. Back to pass. Look at Connor. This side passes to the river. River makes one man miss. Makes another miss. Oh, he's stepped out of bounds. Zero with the push out. Step out of bounds. As he got inside the 40. How he made that man miss and was able to stay, out, stay in bounds. He was going to the house. And let's go down as a game of seven yards on the play. Down to the 37 yard line of Albany State. 6 0 4 left to go here in the fourth. Walk through the gun. First half, handoff, Hughie, near side, first down, and oh, he's going to tackle inside the 20-yard line, and goes down at the 19-yard line. Deshaun Hughie appeared to be stacked up, broke a tackle, got forward, and got a first down. Tigers back in the red zone at the 19-yard line of Albany State, and they're showing some tempo. 538 in counting here in the fourth, Tigers down 10, the back in scoring range up to the team in purple all, his team in all purple here tonight. Pistol formation here for Russell. Thomas right behind him, three receiver set. Tight end wing to the left is Ravion Moore. Takes the snap. Hand up. Thomas, left side, trying to pick his way, still backing his way to the 15 yard line. In a four on the play. In a four on the play for the truth, for the excuse me, the freshman from Gansford County High School, from Gansford County Jaguar. Second down. And six at the 15. 450 and counting here in the fourth quarter. Tigers down 10. Russell looks from the gun. Thomas the backside, call the left. Let's we'll see the pitch. Swings their side to the right. That's Hoff and Rumber. I said it's four spots in the left. appears to be. That is one of the faces that stretch play. Hand up to Hoff. Hoff inside the 10. Hoff's going to have the first down. Eric Hoff on the jet sweep. The receiver is going to move the chain for a first down. Well, Willie moving for the first down. He's sitting down to the 10. And an Albany State defensive lineman has gone down. Appears to be dealing with the cramp. I'll use that as a coach. Now we'll write down on this good defensive lineman, Jalen Q. Well, let's take a look at him. We'll take a quick time out. 4 11 to go here in the fourth quarter. Timer's on the move, but down by 10. Albany State 27, Edward Water 17. Back with more after this here on the Edward Water Sports Network. Since 2002, Empowerment Resources, Inc., a nonprofit organization, has empowered more than 1,500 youth and adults in Duval and surrounding counties. Through its programs, Journey into Womanhood, Girls Mentoring, Life Skills for Teens, 
and parenting education coaching. To get involved with programs, volunteer, or donate, visit www.empowermentresourcesinc.org. Follow us on social media, facebook.com forward slash empowerment.resources and instagram.com forward slash empowermentjax. The human voice has always connected audiences with experiences. Major brands all across America have trusted Kevers Voice time and time again. Conversational powerhouse intel. Russell works from the pistol, takes the snap, turn, and Yuji left side. That was the far side inside the 10, inside the 5. He'll have the first down as he went down and around the 4 yard line. So we first and goal for Amber Waters at the four yard line of Albany State. 343 and counting here in the fourth. Tires down 10. You decide where the punch this one into the end zone quickly. You do have three timeouts at your disposal here. They've got to show some tempo here. You need to get the ball with their hands back on the football. 326 and counting here in the fourth quarter. First and goal for Amber Waters at the four. Shot in formation for Russell. Keeps it outside, guard left. Three receiver set. Takes the snap, hand off, Yuji, right side, trying to back his way, no say, into the end zone, touchdown Tigers! Touchdown, Edward Waters, Deshaun Yuji from four yards out, and the Tigers into the end zone, it's 27-23, pending the extra point. 3-12 left to go. Every three minutes on to the extra point here for the first one on He's got a fall on the defense one more time. Pass, clock, kick, up all the way it is good. We'll keep it here. 3 12 to go here in the fourth. That is on top 27 24. Four yard rushing touchdown for Deshaun Huji. Come the Tigers right back in the contest, but once again, it is going to fall on the Edward Waters defense. They have got to find a way to get a stop here. 3 12 left to go. You have all three timeouts at your disposal, but you cannot afford any chunk plays here. Three and out will do just fine here for Toriano Morgan's bunch. Four yard rushing touchdown for Deshaun Huji. Making this a three-point ball game here. Out on the far side. Making a lot of noise over there. Purple, orange, white, and pink. Every three men on to kick off here for Edward Waters. He's wrong. We see this camera to watch. Tigers need it quick. Stop here. Bring it on to the kick. Bring it approach it here. Is this kick high, deep, and double red? It'll be taken from around the 21. This time to the 25 to the 30. 25 to the 40 yard line. And he pulled a little bit out of bounds there. That was blocked on the return. Albany State will have the football at their own 43 yard line. 311 to go here, fourth quarter. Three point ball game here in Jacksonville. Tigers needing a stop here defensively. Alan Russell has indeed eclipsed the mark he needed. He now becomes the new single season modern era. Passing yards leader from 213 yards here tonight. 194. Congratulations to John Russell. Once again, now for Old Bay State at the 43 yard, their own 43 yard line. Only left and leading by three. Nine seconds, eight seconds on the play clock now. Seven seconds, six seconds. Ivan defensive line got a hold of the ball here. Cancel the penalty. Take the hand off. And far side is complete. Back and back what a great open field tackle over on the far side of the loss of a yard on that play. Dartro Roll making the stop there. On the receiver off of it. Loss of a yard on the play. Back to football up to the 42 yard line. 255 and counting here on the fourth. Tigers down by three. Final way knocks on the field for Albany State. Adjusting defensively. 21 on the play clock. 2.9 on the game clock. 
Bottom of the bag. One back tie draw with his gains. Receivers near side to left three will throw the right is Seven seconds on the play clock now. Six and five. Four seconds and three seconds. Two seconds. Takes the snap. Hand off. Gains up the gut. Stash at the line. Line and push forward and down to the 44 yard line. And a two on the play. Push on the horse will burn his first time out. First time out for Hitchell's corner. We'll keep it here. Third down and nine for Albany State. At their own 44 yard line. 17 left to go here. This quarter of an exciting preseason game. First down by three. 27 24. Back up the road next week up in Columbia, South Carolina. They will take on the Yellow Jackets of Allen University. This is the fourth edition of the AME Football Classic. And the two members of the African Methodist Episcopal Church. Out of the Bishop's Trophy next Saturday at 2 o'clock p.m. up in Columbia, South Carolina. The broadcast aired on our YouTube channel. Here we go, 39 for Albany State. And a drop to 24-yard line. In the gun is Votto. First receiver in motion. Behind end now. Takes the snap. Only one here to the left. Look, look, throws down Anderson pass. It's complete, but a great job. Running air close to make the stop there by DJ Roberts. And then first turn on the water will call the timeout. And Edward Waters appears they will get the football back. Second charge timeout taken by head coach Troy on Morgan, but it looks like the Edward Waters will get the ball back with 2-10 left to go here in the fourth quarter of the play. Here's the coming on here for Albany State. It would be a fourth down and six for ASU. Ball is spotted at the Golden Ram 48-yard line. What a ball game here. 20th all-time meeting between these two teams. Split down the middle at 10-10. Albany State has won the last two meetings between these two squads. Last victory for Edward Waters in this series came back in 1967. A 16-14 victory for the then Edward Waters College Tigers over Albany State. And it goes down now to this Edward Waters offense here. Gilbert Brown coming on to punt. Johnny Jones has to field this one here for Edward Waters. Johnny back up? 13 on the play clock. Face to the snap. Here is the punt from Brown. On the far side. Jones falls to the clear pass. He will make it from the 16 yard line. That is where the purple horns will go. First and ten. Here we go. Two minutes, four seconds left to go. We have a fourth quarter of play. It falls on Jarvis Russell and the Edward Waters offense. It's winning time for the team at Old Purple. Down by three with two of four left to go around the fourth. They have one timeout at their disposal. Russell and the offense on to the field. So far tonight, Edward Waters, 317 yards total offense, 213 for the air, 104 on the ground. First and 10 for Edward Waters, they'll spot the football actually around the 18 yard line. Russell claps his hands, takes the snap, takes the handoff, back to pass, looking, 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 still looking. Russell, going deep, looks for Rembrandt, and it's all incomplete! Rembrandt had his hands on it initially. It looked like the defensive back on this near side. And Cameron Watts nearly mugged Rimber. No flag was thrown. But Rimber had a chance to squeeze that when it falls incomplete. Second and ten now for Edward Waters from their own 18-yard line. 155 to go here in the fourth. Russell on the gun. One back side car worth appears to be here. Twin receiver far side to the left. Nathan Rippert isolated near side to the right. Check that in the back. Staying to the left of quarterback Tyron Russell. 
Takes a little bit. Takes the handoff back to pass. Looking for an far side pass is complete. That's our side of McCorker. McCorker's going to have the first down across the 35, and he will finally go, go down at the 38 yard line. We'll stop the second challenge. First and 10 for Evan Barnes, our side of McCorker. Last week's hero on the Hail Mary. The big first down for Evan Barnes. 147 left to go. Takes the snap. Far side. Pass complete. That's McCorker again. McCorker goes out of bounds. Around the 43 yard line. We'll stop the clock with 141 left to go here in the fourth quarter. Here five on the play. Back in the five, down for Evan Barnes. 141 left to go. Tigers down by three. In the gun is Russell. Thomas the back side for the left. Jones and River near side to the right. All right, so that is five five to the left is our side of McCorker. Reeves will come out. The second chance. One forty-one left to go. Second and five for Edward Waters at the forty-three yard line of the Tiger. Moving right down by three. Looking on the gun. Takes the snap. Takes the handoff. Back to pass. Looking for a far side. Pass is complete. And out of bounds for a first down. At the 41 yard line, that's McCorker on the reception once again. They're in Golden Man territory. The spot of football at the Albany State 42 yard line. Fox Thompson, 136 left to go here in the fourth. 29. Tigers down three. They're in Golden Ram territory. Shotgun formation for Russell. Thomas the backside, Carl they go four wide. Clint to either side of the formation. Our check out is a three receiver. Yeah, yeah, that is twins to either side of the formation. First and ten at the Old Bay State 42. Russell passes hands, takes the snap. Back to pass. Looking, looking. Flush. Rolls over to the left side now. Russell is going to be hit and sacked, but there's a flag, however. Flag thrown in the backfield, the defensive backfield of Albany State. Just this flag appears to start a goal against Albany State. Here is the call from Floyd Willingham. 128. 28. 10 penalty against Albany State will give Edward Waters a first down after the holding penalty. We'll go to the football to the Golden Ram 42 yard line. Let's go to the Ram 42 yard line. 128 left to go here, fourth quarter. Tigers still have one timeout. Pretty much everything is at your disposal now here for Edward Waters. Now all these things will follow the timeout. All these things follow the timeout. We will quickly do the same. 128 left to go, fourth quarter. Edward Waters trailing all these things, 27 24. Back after this one minute timeout here on the Edward Waters. <laughs> The human voice has always connected audiences with experiences. Major brands all across America have trusted Kevers Voice time and time again. Conversational, powerhouse, intelligent, and sincere. That's the voice you need for your creative marketing process. K-E-A-V-E-R-S-V-O-I-C-E dot com. Kevers Voice, Kevers Voice, Kevers Voice dot com. Always on, all the time. Nope. Nope. Come on, him? Ooh, I like him. <laughs> Quick, the quicker picker-upper. Bounty picks up messes quicker, and each sheet is two times more absorbent, so you can use less. He's an eight. He's a nine. Bounty, the quicker picker-upper. From... First and 10 for Amber Hunter with the 32 yard line of Albany State. One minute and 28 seconds remaining with the fourth quarter play here from Jacksonville. Edward Waters trailing Albany State 27 24. 
in the gun is Tyron Russell. Top Terrence Thomas is running back to the right. A four receiver set, twins to either side of the formation. Water Reeves rushing four here. Takes the snap, takes the handoff, run, run aside, pass is complete. Out of bounds goes Yannis Rogers. And if he five on the play, it goes inside the 30 and out of bounds at the 28 yard line. And four on the play. About six from there. 124 to go in the fourth. Shotgun formation for Russell. On the back line from the left. Four receiver set. Takes the snap. Looking. Near side. Pass. Complete. That's Johnny Jones. Goes out of bounds. Jones out of bounds inside the 25. Down to the 24 yard line. It's third down and two now for the Tigers at the goal in round 24. Clock will stop at 119. Let's go here in the fourth. Russell in the gun, Thomas the backside, guard left. Four receiver set, twins on the side of the formation. Third and two from the Albany State 24. Russell takes the snap, takes the hand up, throw down a man up, that's complete, that's the fourth. First rider more, inside the 15, still on his feet, and finally goes down to around the 11 yard line. Our side of the corner moves the change right at Waters first down. First and 10 for Edward Waters. Clock runs now, 110, 109, 108 left to go here in the fourth. First and 10 for Edward Waters at the Albany State 11 yard line. A three point ball game here. Tigers in the red zone, deep in the red zone now. At the 11 yard line of ASU. In the gun is Russell. Four receiver set. Thomas the backside, turn left. Russell takes the snap. Hands up. Thomas coming near side, balls his way to the five. And they're going to mark it at the six. 43 seconds, 42 seconds, 41 seconds. Tigers do have a timeout at their disposal. Lock run, 34, 33 seconds, 32 seconds here. Russell, now it's the signal, he's in the gun. Pass his hand, takes a snap. Looking, drawing, back to the end zone, incomplete! Flat thrown! Flat thrown at the end zone, pass to the parents against the Albany State! Intended for, I believe that was Jones in the back of the end zone. Ball will be placed at the two yard line. First and goal for Edward Waters. 22 seconds left to go here in the fourth quarter. Tigers down three. First and goal at the two. Tigers knocking on the door here. No. Yes, 29. First and goal for Amber Waters at the two yard line. 22 seconds left to go. Full house backfield for Amber Waters. They line up in a loaded pistol. Thomas right behind Russell. Head coach Craig Ray sprints onto the field to call the timeout. Tonight, he was when he played for the teal and black for the Jacksonville Jaguars back in the day. You wasn't that fast. <laughs> and I can say that because Quinn is one of my. He broke for the school that damn kid. Sports Lab with the Dean of HBCU Sports, Dr. Kenyatta Cavill, 
Mike Washington and Charles Bishop at 11 o'clock tomorrow on the Black College Sports Network. At 6 o'clock tomorrow, it's my good friend Brian Fulford and A.B. Drew. BCS and Sports Rap. We have a lot to talk about tomorrow on the Black College Sports Network. You can watch those shows on YouTube, on Twitter, and on Facebook. Also, be sure to download the BCS app. Show your support for the Black College Sports Network. These gentlemen do a fantastic job of showcasing HBCU athletics all across the country. <laughs> It'll be a free day for Jaguars. And the Jaguars took care of business on Thursday. I mean, off the New Orleans Saints. Who that said they're going to beat them back? Brian, I do, I do love you, even though you're a Colts fan. You know. Proud native of Indianapolis, Indiana, our producer for the Black Hills Sports Network. You know, hey, we still love you, though. We still family. We still have that orange and green that we, we, we can share. <laughs> Here we go. Second down and goal at the one yard line. 14 seconds left. Loaded backfield once again, a pistol. Thomas right behind Russell. Well, Sam P.J. Polk. And a timeout taken. Oh, a flat ball. Big. It made after whistles are blown. No flag thrown. That was Jalen Pugh getting a free shot on quarterback Tyler Russell. Last timeout taken. By Albany State. So both teams now are out of timeouts. 14 seconds left to go here in the fourth quarter. What a That's what I said. furious fourth quarter here in Jacksonville. And the water's just one yard away from setting this place into a frenzy. Tigers down by three and 27 24. Are going to get their first victory over Albany State since 1967. Why is that year significant? In Edward Waters' history, that was the year that Edward Waters discontinued their football program after that year. Going in for 34 years, coming back in 2005. Second down and goal from the one yard line. Both teams on the field. Shotgun formation for Russell. Thomas the back to the right. Single receiver still on the side of the formation. 14 seconds left. Russell barking up the signals at the line. Takes the snap. Back to pass. Looking, looking, throwing. Here's the next four minutes. Incomplete. Looking for Fink Simmons. 10 seconds left. It's 30 goals on the one. Looking for Fate Simmons over down the near side right pass falls incomplete. Third and goal from the one yard line. Ten seconds left. Tigers down three. Russell works on the gun. Eighteen on the play clock. Four seconds, three seconds, face the snap, back to pass, Russell far side is Eight seconds left to go here in the fourth quarter. 
Niagara Waters dirty water. Albany State 27. We will keep it right here. What a furious comeback here from this team at Purple Forge. It is just a different ball game here, a different football team here for Edward Waters. This is not the same old Edward Waters football team. If there is time on the clock, this Edward Waters ball club is going to fight you until the very end. We saw that last week against Tuskegee. We saw that the previous week against Lane for the home Betty Lane. We saw that the previous week up on the road against Savannah State. This team is going to give you everything they've got. Writing down, I just was speaking with my uh, good friend uh, and HBCU funded, the great Brian Fulford. He agrees that might have been an offensive MVP winning drive there for quarterback Jarvin Russell. He sets the single season modern era passing record today. He eclipses the great Dexter L. Davis. The effort here today. Russell, 22 of 34 passing, 277 yards, two touchdowns. Eight seconds left. Tigers leading 31-27. The first time Edward Waters has led from the front since the 11-15 mark of the first quarter. They're off to the second state Mitchell's post game report. Here is the kick. High, deep. End over red, take it from the 24, across the 25, to the 30, 35, to the 40, 45, midfield, still on his feet, two seconds left, ball goes from the fumble back, and it's going to be still fumble back, he goes out for this, ball game over, Tigers win, Tigers win, what a comeback here for the Waters, unbelievable job, our final score, here from Jacksonville, Edward Waters 31, Albany State 27. How about this football team in purple and orange? Unbelievable. Let's take a time out. When we come back, we'll begin the assistant. We'll begin the assistant state Vincent Post game report right after this. Here on the Edward Waters Sports Network. Wow. All right, do me a favor. Somebody hand me, somebody hand me a bottle of water, please. Okay, I just hit the red circle. Oh, my Lord. Aves to aficionado. Find yourself here. High quality cigars plus personal customer service. Slow Burn is Waco's only mobile cigar lounge. Featuring a meticulous curated collection of premium cigars. Visit our website, www.slowburnwaco.com. That's www.slowburnwaco.com. Itchy, squirmy, scratchy, family not getting clean? Get Charmin Ultra Strong. Go get him! It just cleans better. With a diamond weave texture, your family can use less while still getting clean. Chief Executive Officer Dr. Ray Zachary Finison Jr., a proud graduate of Albany State University. He's come so close to now hitting the Albany State here at Edward Waters. He finally gets the victory tonight over his alma mater, Albany State. Tigers win by a final score of 31 27. Welcome to the Assistant State Vincent Post Game Report here on the Edward Waters Sports Network. Joshua Jackson here with you. The Tigers' dream of going to the SIAC Championship is still alive as they were down by 10 points late in the fourth quarter of play. A furious comeback for the purple and orange. The Tigers now go to five and three on the year with this victory for Edward Waters. It at minimum solidifies a 500 season at worst for the first time since 2012. A big moment here for Edward Waters here. Tigers also moved to five and two in conference play. A big victory here tonight here against this Golden Ram Ball Club. Again, Edward Waters was down by 10 points. And the midway point to the fourth quarter, but Edward Waters responds with 14 points. The last 14 points, I'm sorry, the last 14 points of this contest to get this huge victory, 31-27 over the Golden Rams of Albany State University. Just what a what a job, what a ball game, what what an effort here by this Edward Waters football squad. Let's look at some 
numbers here from tonight's contest. Edward Waters, 387 yards of total offense, 277 through the air, 110 on the ground for all the state, 282 yards of total offense. They had 97 through the air, 185 on the ground. The time possession won by Edward Waters, 30, uh, 3052 to 2908. Edward Waters, 8 of 14 on third down. Auburn State, 4 of 11 on third down. Auburn State was 1 of 2 on fourth down here tonight as well. Looking individually for the victorious Tigers of Edward Waters University. Jiren Russell, 22 of 34 passing, 277 yards, two touchdowns. He becomes the single season modern era all time, the modern era passing leader as he eclipses. Dexter L. Davis with his effort from back in 2004. Nathan River tonight, four catches for 79 yards to lead the way for Edward Waters. Johnny Jones, seven catches, 73 yards, and a touchdown here tonight. Devin Thompson picking up the game winning touchdown in the fourth quarter of play. Deshaun Huge, injured and all, but had a fantastic effort tonight. 12 carries, 51 yards, and a touchdown. John Terry is not too bad tonight as well. 11 carries for 42 yards tonight for the Tigers of Edward Waters University. Defensively, leading the way for the Tigers, Whitmire Garçon. Almost 13 tackles tonight here for the junior from Fort Lauderdale. He also had a tackle for loss and a uh, tackle for loss in the defense contest as well. Ramon Jordan, 10 tackles tonight here for the other South Florida native for that Edward Waters defense. He's uh, looking at the other side for Albany State. Deontay Bonner, 10 of 19 passing for 97 yards, no touchdowns. He had one interception and he was sacked twice. It was Ludwig, the leading receiver for the Ralph Hunter, the leading receiver for Albany State. Four catches for 35 yards. Devin Dorsey, three catches for 28 yards for the Hornets of Albany State. 20 games, even in a losing effort. Fantastic work here tonight. 26 carries, 143 yards, and a 5.5 yards per carry. Two touchdowns rushing for that young man from right here in Jacksonville. Defensively for Albany State. Leading the way for the Golden Rams with Jalen Pugh, the defensive lineman, nine tackles, two tackles for loss here tonight. Dayton Baker, seven tackles here tonight for the Golden Rams as well. Also, Jalen Mitchell and Rosendo Lewis with six tackles apiece for the Golden Rams of Albany State University. Ever Waters improves their record to five and three overall, five and two in SIEC play. The dream of going to the SIEC championship is alive. It sets up a huge matchup next week up in South Carolina. As the Tigers will take on the Yellow Jackets of Albany State, of uh, Yellow Jackets of Allen University, it'll be a two o'clock PM kick next Saturday up there in Columbia, South Carolina. We'll carry that broadcast on our YouTube channel, so stay tuned for updates on that as well. For Albany State, they record falls now to five and three overall, five and three, and uh, to five and three overall, five, four and two in FIT play. That loss for Albany State might very well put them on the outside looking in. We're trying to get a bit to the SIC Championship. That will do it for the Ascension Sanctions Post Game Report. That will do it for our broadcast here tonight. Here from Jacksonville. What a ball game here from the northwest side of Jacksonville, Florida. A fantastic finish for the Purple and Orange. Tigers in the win column once again. They get a 31-27 victory here at home over the Golden Rams of Albany State University. So, for Rob Macchio back at 10 Cent XL, here's where it's out on the road. For our friends on the Black College Sports Network, Brian Fulford, our producer here, in Jacksonville. My name is Joshua Jackson. We hope you enjoyed the broadcast. If you were the Purple and Orange of Edward Waters, you enjoyed the outcome. Final score one more time from Jacksonville. Edward Waters 31, Albany State 27. Take care. God bless. Remember to make your next move your best move. We'll talk to you again next week right here on the Edward Waters Sports Network. So long, everybody.